Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about area between curves. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, y equals 2 times the third root of x squared, and y equals x, and we want to find the area between the curves here. Well, one thing we're not giving is the lower and upper bound here. So to do that, we actually set the equations equal to each other and see where they're equal, where they intersect. So I take the, well, 2 third root of x squared and set it equal to x. And when does this happen? Well, right off the bat, we can see this happens at, well, x equals 0, right? 0 for both, they become easy, uh, equal, easy to see. The second one is actually happens when x equals 8. And we can see that here. If we plug in 8, third root of 8 squared equals 8. 8 squared is a 64, so 2 times the third root of 64 equals 8. The root of 64 is a 4, so 2 times 4 equals 8, and I think you get it. 8 equals 8. So that comes with some practice simplifying that, but we have our two values, x equals 0 and 8, and these are going to be the bounds of the integration the integral from 0 to 8. Now we want to find the upper equation over this interval. And an easy way to do it is plug in 1 in for x and see which one's higher. It's within the interval. 1 in for x is 1 here. Here it's a 2. Got that. 2 is going to be higher. That's the upper equation. So we have a 2 times the third root of x squared minus the second equation, which is x dx. Not too bad. Now, if you're like me, I don't like dealing with integrals with third roots and squares. I like the fraction, the exponent. So I'm going to rewrite this from 0 to 8 of a 2 times an x to the 2 thirds power minus the x dx, like this. A little easier for me to solve. And so now we want to find the integral of 2x to the 2 thirds power, which is a 6x to the 5 thirds power over 5. And the integral of x is an x squared over 2. And we're integrating this from 0 to 8. So now from here, we first plug in 8 in for x and simplify. When we get this, when we plug 8 in for x and simplify, we get a 6.4. And then we plug 0, I did it for you, 0 for x gets us a 0. And 6.4 minus a 0 is a 6. Point. If I can write it here, 0.4, that's a big decimal point. 6.4. And so there we have it. Our final answer for the area between the curves is a 6.4. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.